everybody, Ace Trainer Liam here and welcome to episode 49 of my Pokemon Alpha Sapphire Quadlock. The reason I didn't say randomizer is because more technical difficulties have hit us. The randomizer is, the randomized element is basically dead. And the more I try and find a fix for the problem, the more kind of posts I come across that say, do not do this fix if you don't know what you're doing because it will erase your save file. And I'm a bit like... I don't fancy being at the Pokemon League and then losing my entire save. So we're just going to finish off the last few episodes of the Quadlock, the, the Pokemon League and the Delta episode, with the Pokemon that we have, and it, it's not going to be randomised. But we're still going to enjoy it. We're still going to triumph in victory. Let's continue. Answer me the question of the day, which is, are you good with computers? Because I ain't. <laughs> Only trainers who have collected the eight gym badges may go beyond this point. Let's evaluate your worthiness. Lovely. Believe in yourself and your Pokemon, go forth. Oh, and I've added Boiler to the team because you guys seem to really want Boiler back. Oh my lord. Okay, I'm going to have to check my <laughs> check my settings here. This is insane. Uh, okay. This is this is live TV. It's not live TV, but let's just uh, check our calibration. Because that's weird, man. There we go. Beautiful. Oh yeah, yoy. So, let's <laughs> head on to the Pokemon League. Yep, I get it. It's a, it's a beautiful place. Come on, come on. Let me go. I want to go now. I need this. Oh my god. Slowest door opening sequence ever. So, I mean, at least we'll have, like, type advantages. So, he has, like... Does he have dark type Pokemon? Is that right? I don't even remember. I know the girl has ghosts and the sailor man has water. Welcome, Challenger. I'm Sydney of the Elite Four. All right, mate. I think he has dark types. So let's put someone at the front that isn't weak to dark. And has focus blast. Switch. Yeah, Sparkle can do it. Hello. I like that look you're giving me. I guess you'll give me a good match. That's good. Looking real good. All right, let's get down to the kind of battle that can happen only here in the Pokemon League. A single battle. Ooh, scary. Don't they all have Megas in this? I think. We'll soon find out. Okay, he's going with Mightyena. Yeah, this is, this is going to be, you know, old school actual Pokemon that they're supposed to have, but it's fine. At least we've still got our Pokemon, our team that we've raised together. Okay, our attack fell, but we're a special attacker, so that's fine. We're going to go Focus Blast, and we're going to hit it first time, please. Why is it? Wait. Oh. Oh. Of course. The randomizer also increased the levels, so they're... Oh, God. We're going to plow through this, guys. About said in Shiftry, will I change Pokemon? Like... All their Pokemon are the levels that they should be. Oh, well, that's bomb, isn't it? But, oh, well. <laughs> These things happen. I'm not worried, and you shouldn't be either. Here we go. Focus Blast again. So, I mean, we've got, like, 20 levels advantage over the Elite Four. That's incredible. This isn't even going to be, like, edge of your seat death thing now. This is, this is pretty good. I'm, I'm quite confident. Things could still go wrong. But probably not as wrong as they would have gone. If we had the randomizer. I wish we did have the randomizer, but I just... If, if it can't work, it can't work. You know what I mean? We'll do another randomized playthrough or us in the future, no doubt. Because the good thing is, is... Um, because, like, obviously, Auras is coming to kind of the end of its life cycle. Game Freak will slowly but surely stop patching it. Which means any exploits that are used on it are going to be, um... Th like, they won't be patched, so we'll be able to use them more. But, hey-ho, these things happen. But we got Carmela up to level 74. Oh, Gino's level 73. Beautiful. You're about to send in Cacturn. Okay. And with Cacturn, let's go with a Focus Blast. Boom. So that's one of the Elite Four down. Let's keep going. Thanks, Sid. Now, if we don't get fake out, fake outed, 
Well, listen to what Deluge has to say. You've got what it takes to go a long way. Go to the next room and challenge your next battle. Alright. Alright, I will. Impressive, right? Ooh. The door closed. This door's going to take an insanely long time to open. Come on. Ooh, ghosties. Wow. I get it. It's a ghost type trainer. I get it. Come on. Crazy. Oh, hello. Uh, it's someone with a creepy kid in the corner. <laughs> I'm Phoebe of the Elite Four. Wonderful. Ooh. I did my training on Mount Pyre. When I trained there, I gained the ability to commune with ghost type Pokemon. Creepy. The bond I developed with my Pokemon is extremely tight. Come on, just try and see if you can inflict damage on my Pokemon. No. I don't like the ghosties. I do like how she's dressed though. I, I definitely think that's that's something I, I'd like more girls around me to wear. Because <laughs> I'm so just dreadful in every single way. Okay, Sparkle, you can do this. You're a normal type. You ain't got to worry. Dusclops probably doesn't even have Eevee light. Come on, man. Nope. Oh, Sparkle, you're going to win the Elite Four all on your own. The whole Pokemon League. Sableye. Oh, Sableye could be an issue. Uh, Thunder. Damn it. Fake out. We always get faked out. Let's go with Thunder again. Please hit. That's it. Yeah, boy. This makes up for all the grinding I've been doing. <laughs> After all that. Let's send him Bennett. Will I change Pokemon? Yeah, I will. No, I won't. I'm just going to go Dark Pulse again. Easy peasy, lovely jubbly. And then you're going to send out Dusk Noir. So, you know, I, I really don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to mess around with Dusk Noir. So I'll probably Dark Pulse, you know, for a change. Come on, there we go. What's last? Hey, level 75 for Floater. But send in Bennett again. I forgot. Does she really have two Bennets? That's weird. That's very weird. I'm mighty confused. Onward we go. We beat Phoebes. We're making good time, people. We're making good time. There's definitely a bond between you and your Pokemon too. I didn't recognise that fact, so it's only natural that I'll ask. Yup, I'd le like to see how far your bond would carry you. Go ahead, move on to the next room. Alrighty, alrighty. Whoops. Ooh, ice types. Okay, who has... Who has a rock type move? You do. So we'll do that. Although, to be fair, Focus Blast would be pretty good if we've got an Aether. We might have, actually. Alright, I get it. Ice type. That's fine. That's fine. Just let me in. Just let me in. Well, that looks very slippy. What's, what's your health and safety policy here? Uh, bag. Max revive. Max ether. Use on you. Focus blast. Okay, in that case... Uh, we'll switch you back. Gino, you, you can rest up, Gino, before we need you later on for when, like, we face Stephen Stone and all that. Okay, here we go. On the precariously slippy floor. Oh, Granny. Welcome, my name is Elsa of the Elite Four. I've travelled far from Hoenn, or the Disney store, so that I may hone my ice-type moves. But all I've seen are challenges by weak trainers and their Pokemon. Oh, well, you're not arrogant at all. 
I wonder what you will show me. I'll show you whatever you want, darling. What a relief it'd be for once I have a serious battle against an opponent. Come on, you creep. She's actually a creep. No, people think I'm a creep, but she's a creep. Do you think these people are born with these names, or do you think they change them by deed poll later on in their lives? Like, um, Gardinia and Glacier and Skylar, who are all, you know, all their names are related to their particular typing. Here we go, Focus Blast. Down goes Glalie. This is, this is going to be a walk in the, in the cake park, or whatever they say. Frost Lass. Oh, man! Oh no, it's an ice type that's totally resistant to fighting type moves. Well, that's fine, because we got Dark Pulse. Dan, you go, girl. It's weird to think that ghosts can faint. That's that's always a weird thing in Pokemon. About sending another Frostlass. Do you normally have two Frostlass? I, I think my... <laughs> I think the, the randomizer has maybe had a lasting impression on this game. I don't remember there being two Bonnets and two Frost Lasses. That's in Walrain. Hey, Walrain. That's one I don't need to Dark Pulse, because Sparkle can just use Thunder. Oh, don't avoid it. Oh, don't use Blizzard. Oh, okay, we, we've got nothing to worry about. Here we go. Eat this, Blubber. Now, one left, one left. Okay, what you got for me? Glalie. I, I swear she does Does she really have two Glalie and two Frostlass? Aren't they supposed to mega evolve? Oh, protect. Come on, come on. Play nice. Mm-mm-mm. There you go. Eat that. You big... Face. Oh, almost a level up. Yay, we beat that Elite Four lady. You and your Pokemon, have how fiercely your spirits burn. My icy moves pale in the face of such all-consuming flames. Advance to the next room. There you will learn how fierce in the Pokemon League can truly be. Yep, that's what I'm counting on. Crikey. Uh, I don't need it. I don't know why I've got a Repel on in the Pokemon League. Whoops. Oh no, he's Drayden, he's the dragon guy. Oh, okay, we will need an ice type then. It's because he dresses like a sailor that I thought he was a water trainer. But then again, that wouldn't make sense because we already faced Wallace, who's a gym leader with the water type, so... You don't know what you're talking about, Liam. Right, switch. Gino, you're up. You know, just for that little bit of variation. And in we go. Help, mate. Old man, you need to wear some clothes. I'm the last of the Pokemon League Elite Four, Drake the Dragon Master. In their natural state, Pokemon are wild things. They are free. At times they hinder us, at times they help us. For those who battle alongside Pokemon as partners, do you know what it takes? Do you know what is needed? A big old moustache like this. If you don't, you will never prevail over me. Oh, I'm going to do so much over you in a second. Hey, boy. Man, you're like a less attractive revolver ocelot. Altaria, how you doing? Okay, Gino, let's make this, uh, let's make short work of this thing. Ice Fang. Take it down. Take advantage of that four times weakness. Way over leveled at this point. <laughs> oh, don't get more levels. I'm sending Kingdra. Ooh, you know, Kingdra could be a bit of a bit of an as your father, you know, with the whole uh, not quite being weak to ice. But you know, have an earthquake, a stab earthquake takes you out. Easy peasy. Cool. Level 66. <laughs> Flygon. Oh, another four times weakness to ice. You know what? I, I noticed, Drayden, you've, you've got a particular problem right there. Down goes your Flygon. 
Who's next? Flygon. I, I know this is broken now. He doesn't have two Flygons. Come on. What's going on? Am I fighting Drayden or a cloud called Klaus? And then Gino levels up like like any of them need to level up at this point. <laughs> this is quite fun. I don't know about you guys, but I'm having I'm having loads of fun. Okay, intimidate's fine because I'm still gonna beat you. I've still got like 20 levels on you, mate. Well, all right, 19. Down you go. And onward to Le Champion. Le Champion. There we go. Superb, it should be said. Thank you. You deserve every credit for coming this far as a Pokemon trainer. You do seem to know what is needed. Yes, what a trainer needs is a true and virtuous heart. It's through their contact with trainers that Pokemon learn right from wrong. The influence of their trainer's good heart helps them throw strong. Go on, onward. The champion is waiting. Old people have gas. That's, that's what that joke is. It's not their fault. Wow, this is an unnecessarily large room. And again, a health hazard. There's no barriers. These doors need to be this big. I mean, who funded this? Surely not the free healthcare system. Oh, look who it is. It's my old friend. It's, it's Steven. I mean, he's facing the wrong way, so he's not that good of a champion, is he? Welcome, baby. I was hoping I would get to see you make it here one day. We're all alone. Tell me, what have you seen on your journey with your Pokemon? I want to see some of you. What have you felt? I want to feel you, meeting so many other trainers out there. Are any as handsome as me? Travelling this rich land of Hoenn, has it awoken something inside of you? A deep love that dare not speak its name? I want you to come at me with all you've learned. My Pokemon and I will respond in turn with all that we know, and will probably teach you a thing or two. I love you! <laughs> Steven's proper... Steven's so hot for me right now. Hey, Stevie boy. Let's see what you got going on. Oh, yeah, I forgot you always start with Skarmory. Although the good thing is... I can do neutral Rock Tomb damage to you, which will lower your speed as well. Oh, that did, that did jack all, didn't it? Steel Wing. That's going to be super effective, you bumbling idiot. Okay, it's only level 57. What about Ice Fang? Maybe we could freeze it. Hey, we got some Quick Claw that we didn't need. Come on, just kill it. Oh, he's laying out spikes, you idiot. Kill it, kill it. Oh, full restore. Are you really doing full restores? Are we really playing that game, Mr. Stone? I wish I had a fire type with me. Come on, do do half damage. Don't do a... F Come on, there we go. Down you go, Skarmory. Pat said in Agron, will I change Pokemon? No, I won't. Because Agron is four times weak to ground type moves. There we go. Sturdy though, sturdy. It's gonna use Iron Tail. Oh, come on! Good, good job, Gino. Do a little Rock Smash. Oh, okay. Into Clay Doll. Okay, it's gonna resist that Rock Smash. That's fine. But we'll totally use an Ice Fang. We're gonna Quick Claw. That's good news. Ice Fang will be super effective on Clay Doll. And take it out. Lovely. So Steven's going to send in Agron again now? Yep. Not a problem. Because we already weakened it, so... Oh, come off it, Steve! Come on! I told you not to play the full restore game. 
Down you go. There we go, quick claw. Now we've got Metagross coming up, that's what we've got to worry about. We're doing alright, we're doing alright. Carmela's level 75. I'm sending Cradley, will I change Pokemon? Nah, I don't feel like I don't feel like changing. Does he normally have a Cradley? He has a weird team. What's that on Cradley's head? Ooh, confused Ray. Alright, alright, you mean business, I get it. Well Let's go for a neutral earthquake. Come on, don't hit yourself, man. Don't hit yourself. There's no benefit in hitting yourself. Oh, nearly. He's going for a Giga Drain, which is super effective because ice, of course, does not resist grass, even though it's super effective against it. If you use a full restore, I swear, man. I swear. Oh, come on, Gino. Gino, don't do this now. Oh, Gino, don't do this now. Um... Can we kill it in one hit? I don't want it to get any more health back, so... Let's go with Margo. Margo will resist that Giga Drain. Okay, that's fine. Just be careful of Rock-type moves. Come on! Oh, we can go Steel Wing, which will be super effective. Beautiful. Down goes Cradley. About to send in Armaldo. Nope, you can take a you can take a Steel Wing as well. Here we go. Ooh, nearly Crush Claw. Come on. Oh, he avoided the attack. Went for another Crush Claw. Okay, okay. I get what you're trying to do. You're trying to destroy me, mate. There we go. So all that should be left is little old Metagross, right? Yeah, it is. I didn't, I didn't change Pokemon and I totally wanted to. Whoopsie. In that case, let's make a quick switch to Carmella. Oh boy. Yep, Metagross is gonna Mega Evolve. Oh, Giga Impact. Oh, Carmella, you need to kill this thing now, mate. Let's go, let's go Earthquake. One hit, come on. There we go. We are the Pokemon League Champion. Ah, oh, and I thought we were going to lose Carmella right at the end. We beat Stevie Wonder. So, I the champion fall in defeat. Just as I have come to expect, you're really, really vigorous. Ace, you are a truly excellent Pokemon trainer. Congratulations to you and your muscly arms. And thank you. I had wanted to learn how you feel about this world and me. What kinds of ideals you've developed with your Pokemon. I feel I was able to find the answer in our battle. The feelings you have for your Pokemon and the way your Pokemon gave their all in battle in response to those feelings. The two together created great power that we could have had. That's how you seized victory today. I feel a thrill of excitement within my groin when we first met, and now I know for sure that feeling was not misplaced. You are rightfully the Hoenn region's new... Oh, go away. Hey, it's way, I've got some advice you've got to hear before you challenge the champion. Huh? Wait, what? Could it be that... It's already over? Oh, God, everyone leave. See, what did I say, man? Didn't I tell you it would be just fine? Ace, you finally done it. When I heard you defeated your own father at the Petalburg gym, I thought perhaps you had a chance, but to think you've actually become champion, you little shit. But congratulations on today's victory. Now go in there with your red-held eye. Ace, 
No, I should call you the Hoenn region's new Pokemon League champion. Come with me, champion. Um, little girl, bugger off. I'm very sorry, but only the muscliest of sexy men can go in this, uh, this room. You need to wait outside with the professor, like a good little uh, girl. No way! Just joking, it's okay, it's fine. Rules are rules, right? Hey, it's honestly, congratulations. I need an adult. Help me. Hey, don't you save my game without my permission. This room, this is where we maintain the records of Pokemon that prevailed through the heartiest of battles. Harshest of battles. It's here that League Champions are honoured and we put their dick pics on the wall. Are you sure? Come, we will use this machine to photocopy a picture of your bum cheeks and the names of the partners who battled alongside you with Triumph over the Pokemon League. Alright. Here we go. Whoop, 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 whoop. Wowza! Da, 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 da. Come on. Hoo <laughs> Wowza! What's happening? No! There we go. We got Margo. We got Carmella. We got Floater. Sparkle! Boiler, who did absolutely nothing. <laughs> and Gino, who got missed because of the weird, the weird sync issue. Yay, we're the Pokemon League champion. I just got a text from PD Winnell. Wonderful. He must have known that I just won the Pokemon League. Oh my god, man. Make up your mind game. So, is it over? Have I been abused? She saw everything. All I wanted was to Mac. Well, look what the cat dragged in. I've been following you around all this time, and all you wanted to do was get with that boy, Steven? We sat on this journey together, right? We should finish it together, you idiot. <laughs> so come on, there's no one in this room. We might as well get it on. Let's do it, baby. <laughs> Don't laugh at your own jokes, Liam. That's really cringy. Yeah, but that's what I'm all about, right? One like equals one cringe? Oh, for triping out loud. I need to figure out what the best setting is for this. Yay! Thanks, Shigeru. So that was the main story. In tomorrow's episode, I am going to cover the Delta episode. So don't worry, you're not going to miss out on that. And then we will continue the Red Randomizer once once we got through the Delta episode. Oh, have that yawn, everybody. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Again, sorry about the Randomizer, but it's, it's not a big deal. But until next time, I'm Ace Trainer Liam. Keep on training.